Hi, I'm Sean Ginnam, and this is Minute Math, and today we're learning about rationalizing imaginary denominators. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help to use Minute Math. We're given this problem right here, negative 5 minus 3i over 7 minus 10i, and we got to simplify. Well, what do I want to do? I look at my denominator, and I'm going to write its complex conjugate, 7 plus 10i. And let's put that in the numerator, 7 plus 10i. What that does, eventually we'll get i's out of the denominator. So now we just have to simplify. Negative 5 times 7, we have a negative 35. Negative 5 times 10i is a minus 50i. Negative 3i times 7 is a negative 21i. And negative 3i times 10i is a negative 30i squared. Now the denominator. Well, the beauty of multiplying by a complex conjugate is to multiply the first two parts, 7 times 7 is 49, and the second two parts. Negative 10i times a 10i is a negative 100i squared. So now we want to simplify, um, <laughs> simplify this whole thing. The main key though is i squared is equal to a negative 1. Okay, so let's bring down the numerator, negative 35, and then minus 50i minus 21i is a minus 71i. And then negative 1 times negative 30 is a positive 30. Over, well, 49 here, and negative 100 times a negative 1 is a positive 100. Let's keep going, combining our like terms here, and negative 35 plus 30 is a negative 5. We still have the minus 71i up here over 49 plus 100 is 149. And that's actually it. That's our final answer. Negative 5 minus 71i over 149. I hope this video was helpful for you. And if it was, please subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video. This helps us make more free math lessons for you and for everyone else. So as always, thanks for watching. Minute Math, Minute Math, when you need help you use Minute Math.